people um today's thursday the 25th and today is my first day in rome well our first day in rome and i'm really excited to visit rome because well out of all the cities we've been through this is the one i've you know i've most wanted to go i've wanted to be in rome since i don't know since a lot of time a long time ago and now we're in rome so we're gonna go visit it and i'll show you around there we have it no way it's kind of crazy to think that I have practically one of the most iconic fountains in the world behind me with hundreds of people in front of me wanting just to take pictures with it. But I have it. No freaking way. See this. Damn. It's beautiful. It looks incredible in person and the crazy people laughing I think it's amazing watching this in person it's a complete piece of art you know it's ways shapes and forms wow I would say it's even better in person than it, it actually is like in the photos because in the photos there's some things that look better in photos than in person. I have to this. This looks better in uh, this looks better in person than in the photos, actually, which is quite weird because usually things look better in the photos than in person. This one not. This one looks way better in person. We're gonna order. I don't know. This thing called house menu. The first course. <laughs> you like it? Yeah, it's First plate was finished. I have to be honest, it was good, but it left me hungry. I need to eat another one. Second plate, it has a, a chicken, some salad, potatoes. I'm gonna lie, I didn't really care about the salad or potatoes, I only care about the chicken. I hope the chicken is good. Finish the second one. The chicken was good, but I'm still hungry, and that's a problem. This kid is wearing a polo, he's wearing some sunglasses, he's having has a watch. Oh man. And his mom cut his pizza. <gasps> now wearing the sunglasses the exact same way he's wearing it. I have a watch just like him. And my mom, when I was a kid, she cut my pizza. So watching a kid like that, I will not show him because it's kind of illegal for me to gives me a lot of uh, nostalgia and makes me really happy. And he's so cool. He's such a cool kid. He's, he's eating pizza. <gasps> wow. This is the Supreme Court. That has to be one of the prettiest Supreme Courts in the world. Just look at it. The Probably the only other Supreme Courts that can compete in a way are the one in London and the one in France but outside from that I don't think there's many Supreme Courts as beautiful as this one I can't understand how people can wear suits with this kind of weather like oh obviously everyone in the Supreme Court needs to use a suit but like I'm sweating like I'm in the beach, it's 28 Celsius, I can't stand it. And I'm not that well dressed and there's people in suits. How, how do they do it? How can a place this beautiful exist? Ah. See how beautiful the Italian flag waves in that fountain. Oh. Can you imagine just working here? Like get, getting every day in the morning, waking up, Eating some nice breakfast, and after that you come to the to your job, and this is where you work. And there's like the milit the, the you know the military people, which scares me a bit because I'm Costa Rican. Where I come from, we don't have military people because we don't have an army, so I'm not used to an army. But watching, oh my god! Wow. Hey, we're in the Spanish plaza. Why is it called the Spanish Plaza? I don't know, but these are the Spanish steps. 
I don't know why they're called Spanish as well. Something related to Spain, I imagine. And see the quantity of people. There's a lot of tourists, there's flags. Why do they have flags? I feel, feel weird watching that many flags. There's a fountain, probably a famous fountain. Because there's a lot of people taking photos of it. It, it's look, it's it's nice. With the steps, it's nice. There's really colorful city with a lot of tourists and a lot of things to do. And I, I really like like when cities are big like this, like Madrid, like London, like cities like this, where there's a lot of people and there's like plazas and great architecture, great stores. It's I really like being here. I feel like at home when I'm. In a big city with a lot of tourists, with a lot of people, where there's like a lot of a lot of things that are going on right now, because this like there's a lot of people surrounding this. I'm gonna comb as close as I can. What what's so spectacular about this? There's a lot of people taking photos of this. I don't even know what that is, but I, I feel good. I feel like I feel alive. I feel like okay, wake up, dude. There's a lot of people. Wake up. These are the Spanish steps. There's a lot of stairs too. Or there's so many people there taking like photos of this. What, what is going on? What is going on? That that's a beautiful design. That's beautiful. Okay, now I see. Okay, okay. Okay, this is called the Spanish Plaza, and I just saw a a flag of Spain. That may have something to do with it. I don't know if it's where the embassy of Spain is. But it is called the Spanish Plaza. Probably some some Spanish dudes did. Whoa, that bird just flew right right through me. Probably some Spanish dudes did a lot of stuff here. This is like where the relations with Spaniards and Italians go through. I don't know, but it's a beautiful place to be. Not gonna lie. We're going through the stairs. Here we have the stairs. Ba 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 da da da. Ta -da -ta. Should I go all the stairs? What do you think? I feel like a little kid. I feel like that kid. I'm gonna go through all the stairs. Who cares? You are lit. I feel like Rocky right now. Ta -da -ta. Ta -da -ta. Ta -da -ta -ta. Oh, now this is beautiful. Okay, now, now it looks more beautiful. I'm a bit agitated because I went through all of those stairs, but I need I need still to get to the top because the top is a place to be. Oh yeah, now, now I see why it is so famous. See this? Oh my god! See that view? Yeah, this view something special oh see there oh. being there in the summer beautiful summer the amount of people that they look like ants and the architecture of the buildings beautiful they told me look better in pictures for me this is okay we have this the church the architecture and the view of rome yeah that is good enough for me. That, that will make it. Even in Italy, you can see some Spanish flags. I was 100% right, this is the Embassy of Spain. This is why here it is called the, the Place of Spain. It's because they have the Embassy of Spain. So it makes all the sense in the world that this is the Place of Spain. And now this is the Pantheon, the Roman Pantheon. I'm all wet, I don't really have an umbrella. So I'm gonna go there just to freaking stop getting wet because I'm really wet. And like not in a good way like in a rainy way and yeah oh see this i 
don't know what that is, but that looks cool. That looks like a moon. Yeah, this looks really cool. We have the Greek people, the Romans, have God. It's quite big, actually. Hmm. Oh, it has hands. Just oh. Yeah, so sometimes we need to appreciate life a bit more because being in places like this is quite a special. So there we have a uh, cross and the Roman pantheon with a bunch of believers that come here. There's a cross of Jesus as well. And all of this, the Roman pantheon with the lights and... Oh man, this is special. This is just special. I don't know who that guy is, but it certainly has a nice statue. Look at it. With a horse. In a great size though, like in a, in a really, really great location. Right there, if we go, like if we continue straight, we're gonna be in the Italian, for, in the Roman Forum. And this guy has a really nice touch. Okay, so behind me we have the Roman Forum. It's really nice. I will not show it to you today because we're really tired. But tomorrow I'll show it to you. And thank you a lot for watching this video and see you tomorrow with a new adventure. Bye! That thing right there is a Colosseum. We'll probably not see it today, but tomorrow we'll take a look. This is the Roman curb. Not bad, huh?